I'd like to go over a few points uh, for those of you that are newcomers to playing fingerstyle guitar. Maybe you've been playing for a while, you've been playing with a pick or you've been, been strumming on chords. Um, so just, just a few ideas for you. Now first of all, I'll, I'll just say that when I play, I rest my little finger on here. Now technically speaking, that's, that's really it's a bad habit, but it's a ha bad habit I got, got into a long time ago. But um, I, I can play that without actually resting my finger, but it's just a habit that I got into. But I would su suggest to you, you find whatever way feels comfortable for you. But if you've been playing open chords, even these kind of things, what I want you to do is to start getting a kind of rolling motion with the finger style. So we can start off just by doing this kind of thing. Now generally speaking, the lower strings, we would use the thumb. But there are, there is a kind of crossover point and that's really up to you, whatever, whatever feels comfortable for you. So we can get some exercises going here this kind of thing, then we can play alternate strings. That can sometimes be tricky once when you've been used to maybe just strumming the guitar or even just playing these kind of rolling movements. When you get to play jumping strings that can sometimes feel a bit a bit strange at first and when you first start doing that you you know you'll probably miss strings I still do that myself sometimes when I'm playing and I, I, I jump for a string and I miss it after a while you get to you get to be able to really judge it and, and get a good feeling for it you, it's almost as if you you visualize that in your mind uh, where everything is as you close your eyes sometimes if I got my eyes closed I can I can kind of see where the where those strings are. And then when you've got this, you can start changing chords. Now I'm not going to give you any precise, specific exercises for this because I want you to kind of make up some things of your own. And as you get more proficient with this, start speeding up a little bit, slowly but surely. There's no rush. The great thing about this site is that you can just take your time and don't rush forward. You can just keep going back to things. You know, you don't have to move on until you feel comfortable, you feel that you've actually learnt the lesson. So you can start getting these kind of very short time that will start feeling very natural for you. Just do it very gently. Don't, don't try to play loud or very hard. 